is they want secession from China. And as I explained, they will, this would not, this won't be accepted. Uh, the only people I feel sorry for are, I think, uh, perhaps some young people in Hong Kong who are misled into participating in riots by people, the leaders of the rioters, who didn't even dare to put forward their goals. I, I feel slightly sorry for these people. But the, I mean, that could be dealt with into the law. But never Then they would like quite like some chaos, because they think that that will damage the economy um, of Hong Kong. But they're carrying out things which no country would accept. This is not a question of people having demonstrations. This is people using deadly weapons, petrol bombs, and there are also cases, you know, stabbings, uh, serious beatings, um, and, the, and these types of things. This, no, no country will accept this. I mean, if you had had six months of rioting of this scale. In an American city, it would have been crushed. The National Guard would have been sent in and they would put a stop to it. The advantage of the national security law is it makes very clear what are serious crimes for which you will receive severe punishment Therefore, you'd better not do it. it. But its fundamental idea is to draw a clear line between the people who engage in very serious crimes and massive people who may be confused or worried or got some concerns. So far, I, I think that that is what is the intention. So far, this seems to be working rather well.